So what we have here is the Art Captain MiG-200. <clears throat> and I'm going to show you how to put this 10 pound spool of wire in your machine. So what you're going to do is open this up. These are your drive rollers. Make sure you have the proper drive roller for the size wire that you're using. We're using 8.8 millimeter or 0 .030. Now, what you want to do is if you notice right here, your wire is pinched off in there. Now, you want this wire to unroll from the bottom. So what we're going to do is we're going to pop this out like so and make sure you have your finger on it because this thing will unspool and make a big mess and then you're just going to have a lot of problems now what I'm going to do is I'm going to clip this bent end off keep my finger on this line up this little slot with this lug right here. Feed it through while keeping tension on the spool. It's gonna come out here and you're gonna to wanna to get it lined up in that groove and there's a little opening right there that goes into your torch. Now, we'll close that. Take your lug. And you don't want to have too much tension on this. And we are loading in solid core wire, not flux core wire. So when you're doing this, make sure your gas is turned off so you're not wasting a bunch of gas when you go to feed your torch. So what we're going to do is we're going to grab our torch. We're going to turn our machine on. And then, <clears throat> you want to stretch your line out, stretch your lead out, like so. You squeeze the trigger, and it, you'll hear it pick up speed as it's starting to feed. And you can actually feel it coming through the lead also. And it seems like we may have an issue. So let's go take a look. You want to make sure you don't have too much tension. You want to be able to run that out. We might have had too much tension.
It's jammed. It's jammed in here. So and there we have it stuck out. Sometimes you can take this little tip off. Your machine will come with a wrench like this and you can just twist that off and then you can slide this back over it. And make sure you're using the right size tip uh, for the wire that you're using and you should be all good. And we actually should replace this. Now, what you wanna do just put your gas diffuser back on. Like so. And then you want to make sure that this... I'm going to grab a glove real quick just because... Actually, do this. Make sure... It doesn't push away if it does start pushing your hand away and not bending down you have too much tension on your drive roller and this is how you spool a mig welder with the art captain mig 200 thanks for watching